today I'll be working on, on this toolbox that I uh, did from the last time. I recorded the whole thing and didn't work out too well, so that's okay. But I'll be using this piece of piece of red oak, this, this scrap piece, as a, as a as a handle, which I'll be drilling through a hole right here. But first, I would like to take a minute and talk about shop safety. Be sure to read, understand, and, uh, and follow all the safety rules that come through power tools. And third, always have a beer. <sighs> now, let's get to this project. Now, all, all I have to do is, is, uh, is prune down, is prune down this edge here, the, the, the edges, to make it fit make it fit into this three quarter inch hole that, that I use that I, I use my three, I use the three quarter inch spade bit and I just, I just have to shape it down until it fits tightly then I'll, then I'll, cut, then I'll cut a slot right here on the bandsaw and, and I'll put a wedge inside it like this on the prototype like that that'll make it fit nice and tight and I'll put some glue in there, and it'll be done. Well, the toolbox didn't work out too well. Um, that oak, the oak, the oak rod I made didn't work. So, what I think I'll do now is is work on that DVD. It's called a DVD case edition for my upstairs thing I'm working on that I put together two years about a year ago. I don't have a, I don't have a prototype. I'll have this. Old drawing. It's a. Uh, I'll I'll I'll, I'll figure the measurements, but it, it'll, it'll work. I'll be easy. It won't take long at all. I'll, I'll be making that out of white pine, some knotty pine. I'll show I'll, I'll show you some I'll show you some samples. In there. This is where I'll be putting my my DVD edition right on top here as the last piece to the to the whole the whole set. I made this one in February. I made this one in March. Both made of white pine, stained red mahogany. Came out beautiful. Um, basically, it'll be, it'll be it'll be about eight by eight inches high, and about four and a four feet and a half an inch long. And I'll be staining it the same color, which will probably be the most time-consuming part. And also making these things called plugs. They're plugs that cover all, cover all the screw holes. Now I'm going to use my homemade router table to put on a put, to round to round off the edges with, with, with the router table. Um, these boards are cut at four foot exactly. Well, they're real nice boards. There has to be some sand to be done, but that, that's what I'll wonder. Um, The only bad thing is that there's a couple of knots hanging out. Uh, it's number two grade, so it's not the worst. And number three grade is the worst. There's a couple uh, pith shots right there, right there. That's all right. I'll put this as the as the bottom of the and face that face that face this part of the back. I'll face all this crap to the back of it. As long as I remember. But yeah, all I'm gonna do is round off the edges. And then, th then it'll be time for now. Some it's one of these kind of breaks. Dip break. Beer break. And then, my favorite part of woodworking, sanding. Yeah, let's get a sand. Let's get a sand all the impurities out. I did pretty well on the on the routing, on the, on the router table. It does a nice job. But I had to work on it right in here. Oh, oh, too much chatter, too much chatter on there. Then I just gotta sand this one. And then, uh, then I just had to build the sides, which is which is only two cuts on the which is only two cuts on the on the way to arm saw. <laughs> It'll only take about three minutes. Um, yeah, this, this is all ready to go. I just, gotta, I just gotta finish the beer and have a dip while well, I'm dipping all sand. Alright guys, I finished th this thing. Um, it's my DVD uh, edition. It's, uh, 
the boards were kind of warped, but that's okay. I was sitting here chilling with a, with a, with a chill. Um, I cut the back board right here. It's a piece of the lawn board. That, that's what they use for most cabinets. But uh, I'm going to attach the back after I finish it. And then I'll take a picture and, 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 uh, and I'll edit it in this video excuse me, tomorrow. Alright guys, thanks, thanks for watching the Hold Up Workshop. Work safe and have fun.